What's good, guys? Today is Saturday, June the 12th, 2021. This story came out less than an hour ago. Chicago weekend violence. Ten victims hit, one fatally, in mass shooting in Chatham neighborhood early Saturday morning, police say. So early this morning. And this is coming via the Chicago Tribune in an article wrote by Denise Williams-Harris. At least 10 people were wounded in a mass shooting in the Chatham neighborhood early this morning that saw one woman die, Chicago police say. The victims are among two dead and 18 injured in shooting since Friday afternoon, police said. Shortly after 2 a.m., a group of people were on the sidewalk in the 7500 block of South Prairie Avenue when two gunmen approached and opened fire. A 29-year-old woman suffered wounds to the abdomen and left knee and was pronounced dead at the University of Chicago Medical Center. Nine others were shot and taken to area hospitals. A 46-year-old man suffered a wound to the buttocks and in, is in fair condition at Northwestern. A 26-year-old man was shot in the right leg and was in fair condition at Northwestern. A 27-year-old man suffered a wound to the right ankle and was in fair condition at South Shore Hospital. A 41-year-old man suffered a wound to the left foot and was in fair condition at St. Bernard Hospital. A 30-year-old man suffered a wound to the right ankle and was in fair condition at the U of C Medical Center. 32-year-old man suffered wounds to the right hand and leg and was in fair condition at the same hospital. 34-year-old woman was shot in the left arm and shoulder and was in good condition at Jackson Park Hospital. 23-year-old man suffered wounds to the right arm and left leg and was in good condition at the same hospital. Another 23-year-old man shot in the left foot also was in good condition at the same hospital. In another fatal shooting shortly before 9 p.m. yesterday, a 20-year-old woman was killed while riding in a, na while riding in a vehicle in the Gage Park neighborhood in the 4700 block of South Rockwell Street. The woman was with her boyfriend when someone approached on foot and yelled gang slogans before opening fire. She was struck in the neck and left hand and was taken in critical condition to Mount Sinai Hospital where she was pronounced dead. Police said at least nine other victims were injured in city shootings from 3.30 p.m. yesterday to 2 a.m. this morning. Shortly after 2 a.m. this morning, a 42-year-old man was standing in an alley in the 4300 block of South Champlain Avenue in Bronzeville when he was shot in the abdomen and the back. He was taken to Stroger, where he was listed in good condition. Shortly after 1.10 a.m. this morning, a 22-year-old man was shot while he was walking in the 3700 block of West Augusta Boulevard in the Humboldt Park neighborhood. Suffered wounds to the right leg and thigh listed in good condition at Stroger. 12.10 a.m. this morning, a 21-year-old man was shot while he was walking in the 7600 block of South Marquette Avenue in the South Shore neighborhood, taken in good condition to the University of Chicago Medical Center with wounds to the left leg. Last night at about 11.50 p.m., a 15-year-old teenager was shot in the right leg while he was walking with a group of people in the 10,400 block of South Aberdeen in the Washington Heights neighborhood. Taken to Advocate Christ Medical Center in Oaklawn, listed in good condition. Shortly after 11.15 p.m. last night, a 25-year-old man was dropped off by his girlfriend at Jackson Park after being shot in the legs, plural, in the 6200 block of South Stony Island Avenue. Police said he was not cooperating with officers, but was listed in good condition. Shortly after 8 p.m. last night, a 26-year-old man was shot in the Gresham neighborhood in the 8500 block of South Parnell. He was a passenger in a vehicle when someone opened fire, approached and opened fire, hitting him in the face. He was taken to Advocate Christ, where he was listed in fair condition. Around 6.50 p.m. last night, a 33-year-old man and a 29-year-old man were shot in the 7500 block of South Kingston in the South Shore neighborhood. 
The victims were on the sidewalk when someone opened fire, striking the elder man in the right arm and the younger man multiple times in the body. Both were taken to University of Chicago Medical Center. Shortly after 3.30 p.m. yesterday, a 22-year-old was shot in the Inglewood neighborhood in the 6900 block of South Laughlin, suffered wounds to the hand, and was taken in good condition to UFC Medical Center. No one was in custody for any of the shootings. That's the punchline right there. No one was in custody for any of those shootings I just discussed. But detectives are investigating them. <laughs> so I definitely wanted to bring this to the channel because it just came out. Um, but wow. 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 Uh, not only is Miami-Dade uh, apparently going to have a bloody summer, as the detective said, but Chicago is well on its way. Um, it's so scary. So, so scary. I'm going to end the video on that note. Thanks for watching, guys.